so um, I use my phone outside under the sun quite a lot with stock touch whiz and the auto brightness setting enabled the whole phone in the sun thing it, it kind of works okay because touch whiz really kicks up the brightness to an incredibly bright backlighting and that really helps to be able to read certain text in with a back with a dark background. Um, you can't read everything. You can't read it really clear, but it helps quite a lot. But if you're using um, the manual brightness setting instead of auto brightness, then you lose that extra brightness capability, and you'll also lose that extra brightness capability if you're using a non-touch whiz ROM, like Cyanogen Mod or some other ROM based on uh, some other code. Um, my favorite ROM uh, is uh, Slim ROMs, and uh, it's got the same problem. It, it doesn't have that extra brightness capability that TouchWiz, with the auto brightness setting enabled, is going to give you. Um, but I've I've figured out a way to get that that uh, extra brightness back, and not only do you get it back, but you get it back on demand by pressing a single click of an application. And um, I've gone ahead and created three applications for you. Uh, one is going to be a click to get you that extra brightness. Boom. Lights up the entire screen. Uh, just like if you're running a TouchWiz ROM with auto brightness enabled and you're out in the middle of the sun. And you'll get the exact same extra brightness by clicking this application. The other two apps are, uh, one is just to restore your normal brightness setting and then the other is to restore auto brightness setting, a normal auto brightness that you might get with um, like a third party auto brightness application uh, like Lux, which is a really great app, or the normal auto brightness that comes with AOSP. Um, so the app works on, uh, I've tested it on the T-Mobile Galaxy Note 3 phone, running a couple different versions of AOSP, um, Slim ROM, and uh, a CROM variant that I like quite a lot. Uh, it works great um, and it's really easy to install and really easy to use. Um, so I'll go ahead and walk through the settings here. Uh, I'll walk through the installation and show you how to use the applications. So first you'll you'll download the applications which you can find in the thread that I've got dedicated to this. Uh, so just go ahead and locate the uh, the applications in your your folder browser on your phone. So here we go, there's CZ Automatic Brightness, CZ Manual Brightness, and CZ Sunlight Brightness. Um, automatic, of course, is Automatic Brightness. Manual is man Manual Brightness. And Sunlight, that's the one that's going to give you that peak horsepower worth of backlighting. So we'll go ahead and click on them to install. Click Next, and then Install. And done. Then go to the second one. Install. Done. And then go to the third one. Okay. So now. Hey, <laughs> be quiet. Okay, so now what you'll do is you'll go to your app browser, locate your three new icons. I'll just go ahead and drag them to the desktop just to make things easy for us. And there we go. All right, so uh, automatic brightness is pretty, pretty self-explanatory. Click it, auto brightness is enabled. Click manual. And then manual brightness is enabled. So you can see here that manual is not is is turned on. Auto is not. Hey puppy, be quiet. I'll go ahead and adjust manual to something that's an extreme, so we'll be able to easily tell the difference. In this case, I'll go ahead and turn manual brightness all the way up. That's as far as it goes. That's as bright as manual brightness goes. Now I'll go ahead and uh, enable the sunlight brightness. And this is going to require root here. Go ahead.
ahead and grant root permissions. And you can see that all the colors have gotten kind of weird on us. These are, this is, this is basically really pushing the colors all the way through. And so it's going to look terrible. But if you're out in the sun, it's going to make things easier to see. You can notice here the whites are really just kind of brilliant white. Gains turned all the way up. The, uh, the normal internet icon down there is kind of weird looking. It's got the different colors. And well, let's go ahead and enable the maximum manual brightness. Let's go back to that and see what the difference looks like. Okay, well, we'll go to automatic brightness then. Now that's automatic brightness. Okay, now we'll go to manual brightness. So this is max auto, excuse me, max manual brightness right here. I'll show you. Max manual brightness. Now we'll go to sunlight brightness. See that? The contrast has really changed. The gain of the whites has kicked way up. And trust me, this is going to be a lot easier to see in sunlight. I mean, it's going to be like at least a good 5, maybe 10% easier to see. Now, it's not going to be a miracle for you, but it's going to be a lot better than what you had. Anyways, I hope you like it. Go ahead and leave some comments and let me know how things work out, if you have any problems. And otherwise, enjoy.